push your balls right on in there. Just slide them into that slot. <laughs> I'm gonna have some serious ball spillage. The strife is super annoying. So if I blow my load right into the, the, the sock, um, then it's easy to clean up. It feels strange to say, but I would actually prefer the Centurion. Super creamy, I love it. So that's one mighty ball set. And it looks like my blaster has a boner. <laughs> Behind the boner handle, or the carry handle, it should be fine. I don't know if jostle was the right word there. Fondle the balls. <laughs> So pulling it out is super easy and also very important. You want to make sure to fully penetrate before anything goes off. Oh my gosh. On topic, on topic. The jams occurred when two balls tried to get in there at the same time. Take turns, bros. But if you experience any jams or caught balls in the... <laughs> but if you experience any jams or get your balls in a bind, that's how you... Okay. <laughs> oh, I love the deploy. So I'm going to unmask myself to my most purest form. A jolt race scan. What are you what are you doing? Freaking iCloud backup. F off, Apple. Come on. I'm trying to get my password, aren't you? It's obviously 6969. <laughs> Apollo feels more like a pistol with a really big butt that you're not supposed to touch, or it goes the wrong way too. Yeah, that, that's gotta be weird. But your space program probably saves a load of money. You can just kind of drop rockets off the planet. Out and then all of your balls are gonna drop. And <laughs> Welcome to Coop's Nerf Buyer's Guide. This is a list of the top five blasters in a given category for potential buyers, you, to consider before your next Nerf purchase. Alpha Trooper is a great option. And number one, numero uno, the big winner, the Centurion. Um, I bought it at 25 feet. I could cut it down because my balls don't actually fill that. <laughs> Innuendo. When it's not creamy, it kind of feels bad, if you know what I mean. Sure, I personally prefer the Centurion. If you're going for a mega sniper rifle feel, the Centurion is just better. This blue gun holds uh, 12 bullets in the clip. Um, have to undo that. Uh, the orange clip, it holds 12, like I just said. And then I also have a cool uh, uh, stock in the back that has a six round clip. This one holds six bullets. Not quite right. I want a little bit more foam. Just the way I like it. Oh, hello. Welcome to another Bath Time with Franklin. Bath Time with Franklin in which Franklin takes a bath in Nerf blasters by just pushing in your balls. The internal, <laughs> quite frankly, it's just really fun to shoot a missile at someone. Included is the blaster, blue balls, and the instructions. So if you're under 13 or 14, it might be a little too much for you, but I think that's what they are going for. I'm teaching you how to blow. Oh my gosh, this is so inappropriate. I feel like it's inappropriate, but it's like really important if you're trying to get performance blowing. I mean, <laughs> ask your mother how to do this, she'll know. Just feels sort of like the hyperfire and the rapid strike got together and then made this, and then they listened to that Ellie Golding song. And they're like, boom, yeah, I like triangles too. I'll just put one right there. That's pretty much how the Infinis came to be. Triangles are my favorite shape. That's my theory. I'm sticking to it. If you pump harder, it's gonna shoot a little bit hard. The select fire, by its very nature, will fit absolutely anybody, unless you're a Springer peasant. If that's the case, you can get the f out of here right now. Just kidding. Just kidding. No, I'm not. Get the f out. Get the. Why are you? Get the f out. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, no, I'm really not. Yes, I am. Shut up. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> oh, internal conflict. <laughs> See if you really put some muscle into it. Just stroke really hard. <laughs> you are the most elite blower on the field. Um, to, to blow. Have to get a nice, the, the, the optimal grip angle here. So you just have to regularly inspect your nuts. <laughs> I'm Frank, this is a video review of the Nerf Jolt. And that is actually it. You have a barrel, a trigger, a priming handle, and a grip. That's a jolt for you, bros. Let's see it fire. Is that what you expected? If not, what were you expecting? I feel like I have to push my finger like way too deep in there. So I don't like shoving my fingers into, I'm not gonna finish that sentence. Awkwardly shaped holes. <laughs> With this amount of Nerf firepower, no Zambi Horde can stand in your way. I feel like I can just swim through them. <laughs> in the last con, uh, it, it jams, like a lot. And this is actually not my first double dealer, this one's my second one, because during the filming of this video, I had a, 
let's call it a catastrophic failure. Is that, did, did, I think I got it on video. Boy, that escalated quickly. I mean, that really got out of hand fast. Yeah, P perhaps, a, perhaps a little bit of an overreaction. Now we need ammo, lots of ammo. We need more. <laughs> to purchase them, it's kind of like putting on a bra backwards. Don't have experience putting on bras, just taking them off. Oh. Ayo. Does, <laughs> Does the AR-15 have an in-strike barrel lug? No, bro, it doesn't. It's got a threaded barrel. Ugh. <laughs> That's funny, dude. 59 likes, of course. I'll like that, too. <laughs> so the back of each little rocket has, like, a, a hole that you stick the... <laughs> You stick the pole in, oh my gosh. You, you just you just take it from behind and oh my god. I mean, look at him. Who wouldn't remember flinging foam at that? The wall. Oh. Talk about voyeurism. <laughs> the little rod inside the mortar goes up the same hole that this thing just went, oh my gosh. I cannot make this video. Kids are gonna get opened. <laughs> Man, on camera it looks like I'm about to tell ghost stories. There was once a blaster so bad, it was worse than to deploy. Dun, dun, dun! So hopefully you guys enjoyed watching me get wet, giggity. Okay. In the groin. Woo! Oh, we're doing this, bro. We're doing this. Next combo, because apparently it never gets old. Hashtag sniper status, bros. Oh. Sniper status combo, of course, is for anybody engaging zombies beyond 9,000 meters, whatever a meter is. To reach out and shoot zombies super far away, you need a longer barrel, because of course, the longer the barrel, the longer your accuracy. Why three scopes? Because they magnify with each other, and you multiply it to so like 9x magnification. 9x, 9x, what's 9 times 9 times 9? No effing idea, but really big. <laughs> And that's the point. So if you're engaging at 9,000 meters, because with a super long barrel, you can obviously shoot that far, you have to see that far. Have you ever tried to look 9,000 meters with your naked eye? It's hard. Just don't look at the moon. That doesn't count. I would prefer it to be a little larger, but it works. I feel like a woman. <laughs> Behind the carry handle is a modulus red dot. Yes, the entire vision is impeded, but it looks pretty cool. So cool, in fact, that I put another one on there. Because just like scopes, the accuracy stacks. This is a 1x reflex sight. This is a 1x reflex sight. Do you know what 1 times 1 is? It's irrelevant. We're all gonna die! Ah! Holy balls. Every day I operate. This combo features a few modulus barrels because the longer the barrel, the longer the accuracy. Topped off with the long range barrel just for that extra 10% boost at the end there. Up top, modulus scope because obviously you need to be able to see way out there. It looks way cooler up here, but perhaps it would be more appropriate to put like right here so when you're looking through the camera lens, you can see further, ignoring the DJI Phantom's ability to bear this much load. You know, irrelevant. It's just physics, you can just ignore that. <laughs> <laughs> 